Hello and welcome everybody to yet another video. In today's video we're actually gonna check a breeding box uh, of Lamprima Adolfine. So here you can see a small male of Lamprima Adolfine. They are really really nice, have a lot of colors, um, are quite a fast stack beetle to breed. Um, sometimes it just takes one year for the larvae to become adults. So yeah, very very nice. This is actually not the father of the of the breeding box or of the larvae that we may find. Um, this is a new male that I got as just a show animal. Um, the actual father died, um, I guess, two months ago or three months ago. And here we have the breeding box. It's just a 22 liter box. Um, I had one male and one female in here. I just have about. 10 centimeters of substrate maybe here um, with some soft white rotten wood and I think one block of medium um, hard white rotten wood and I just put one male and one female as I said so yeah let's um, see what we have here I don't know if we actually if we're gonna find any larvae because um, I don't know if the, if the female lived I didn't see her ever again uh, after the introducing her to the breeding box. It's very very small, the female is very tiny but um, yeah. Good thing is that the substrate is nice and moist. I actually I don't remember how many uh, wood blocks I put in here. Here we have one. Ah, it looks a little bit... oh we have something right here. Ah, that's an earthworm. <laughs> We have one earthworm right here. Okay. Um, I will take all the wood pieces out of here and then we're gonna check if we see some larvae. So I have actually inverted the box, it's now empty. And as you can see we have a lot of mycelium on the bottom here. Which is not so bad. And here the, the wood is completely... Um, yeah gnawed through here. Here we have one piece of wood. It's still quite hard. So I might not be able to open it right now here. Here is another piece. As you can see, yeah, a lot of a lot of um, mycelium here. No larvae till now. And sometimes it just doesn't work. Sometimes you don't get any any larvae. Check this big block here. Ah, but everything is is like pelletized here, so I think there should be a larvae here, actually. Ah What do we have here? We have a larvae of Lamprimado and it's a big one already. As you can see here, one larva of Lamprima Adolfine. So at least that means that the female was uh, fertilized, <laughs> otherwise we could not have gotten a, f uh, a larva here. I don't see any ovaries, so could be that it is a male. I'll just put it right here with a little bit of substrate. So, and let's continue the search here. Yeah, actually I will um, go through all the substrate and then I will show you the result. So, as you can see here, I broke open one of the wood blocks and I have two large L3 um, Lamprima larvae in here. Sadly, I'm actually almost through the, all the substrate and I only, including those two, I found five larvae. So, yeah, from one female, but just five. I actually also found the female here. Um, it was a nice purplish female, but it's of course the dead. 
yeah, so I will uh, continue to go through here and then see how many um, I got. So, um, yeah, I'm finished uh, going through the box and I only found those 5 L3 larvae. I mean, it's from one female, that's not a lot, um, can be a lot more than this, but um, yeah, as I said, I wasn't expecting any. Um, because the male died very early and I didn't know, I didn't actually see the female at all. So yeah, I was not sure if she laid at all. But yeah, at least we got five larvae and yeah. I don't know if I'll be giving them away or we'll see updates in the future. For now I'm gonna um, separate them each um, into flag soil and then we'll see how they're doing. So thank you everybody for watching. I hope you enjoyed this very short segment of... Uh, checking the Lamprima box and if you did leave a like and uh, maybe a subscribe and I would like to see you in the next video. Thank you everybody.